Welcome to the Happiness Matters podcast with me, your coach, Julia Seal, where we explore the puzzle of whole being happiness as professional women in our midlife, how to coach ourselves and live into the best version of ourselves, resilient, creative and thriving, no matter what. Welcome everyone, welcome to Happiness Matters in Midlife and Happy New Year. Welcome to 2021. Fraser and I have been on a bit of a break, so I'm delighted to be back with you. I'm also really excited as this is the beginning of the next series, Series 2. Series 2 is going to be so much fun. It's all about brain management in our midlife. So of course I know that brain management really doesn't mean much to you right now. It sounds awfully dry and honestly a bit odd, doesn't it? (laughs) But I hope it's also intriguing because it's key to your happiness, key to your midlife and key to happiness in all your relationships with your loved ones, with your work and your purpose and with your very own self. As odd as it sounds, It's super exciting. This is where we really get into the detail of coaching our crazy, puzzled, midlife brains. (laughs) So today is a quick overview of Series 2 and an introduction to the four basics of brain management. I'll also link back to Series 1 so you can see how all the episodes work together and how you're never lost wherever you start. And I've got some special things planned for how you and I can work together this year, including my new midlife habit challenges. So be sure to sign up on the website happiness-matters.coach and join me. It's a new year. It's now time for us to craft our resilience, creativity and our thriving in the face of not just our midlife, but another year navigating life during COVID-19 second and possibly even third waves. I want to jump straight into the discussion we were having at the end of series one, where I introduced the idea of puzzling to you, happiness as a puzzle. So seeing your midlife happiness as a puzzle, and it probably is quite a puzzle, isn't it? (laughs) Or puzzling anyway. Life in midlife changes so much. Our brains in menopause can feel fuzzy and puzzled and the way forward is often not clear. We start questioning everything. Our relationships, our work, how we've looked after our health, our money, and we very often start spiraling in confusion, getting more and more puzzled and even stuck. Stuck at midlife. So yes, you might be puzzled, and that's the secret to all of this. Your puzzle (laughs) is your way out of puzzled and stuck. Think of your happiness, your future midlife happiness. Deep contentment in every aspect of your life. Think of this yearning for a meaningful life. What you want as resilient, creative, thriving, whole being no matter what as your picture of your life, your picture of happiness, your jigsaw puzzle picture. This is what we're doing here together. We're understanding, solving, creating your unique jigsaw puzzle of deep happiness in midlife. What it looked like, how to do it, and how to be it. 2020 really was the year of reviving the jigsaw puzzle, wasn't it? with so many of us around the world living through various forms of lockdown or stay-at-home orders. Puzzling has now become one of the most popular pastimes to fill our long summer evenings or chilly winter nights as we limit our social interactions. Something other than falling into COVID-19's black holes, like over-binging on Netflix (laughs) or endlessly scrolling social media. So let's use this pandemic trend to bring life to your midlife stuck, seeing your midlife happiness as your very own puzzle. What we did throughout series one is to create the four sides of the jigsaw, the outline of your happiness puzzle. 
These four edges are what make up the outer edges of your happiness puzzle. Defining and assessing and visioning and my happiness wisdom concepts are core concepts affecting your happiness in midlife definition. They're the starting basics of any coaching journey. In your podcast player, you'll find 56 episodes in series one. And I know (laughs) that is a lot just for a puzzle outline. And I've created a free download guide to how these 56 episodes fit together into the four sides of your life puzzle. You can get this from the website happiness-matters.coach in the fun and free section. For now, all you need to know is that there are only six core episodes and the rest, all the other 50 episodes, add depth and richness to inspire you with food for thought, to spark curiosity as to how you might want to think about, dream about your midlife happiness and what it can be going forward from now. Please don't get overwhelmed by this depth. It's here for you to explore at any time. That's the beauty of podcasting. It's there to add interest, fun, and further insight in how you're currently choosing to define, assess, and vision your happiness, where you are now, and where you want to be, where you're going on your happiness coaching journey. And you can dip in and out of these episodes throughout your midlife happiness journey. In other words, you can make your happiness puzzle outline as big or small as you want. It could be as huge as the largest Disney jigsaw puzzle of 42,000 pieces covering about 13 square meters, or as tiny as the smallest jigsaw puzzle in the world. A hundred pieces, but only five millimeters squared. Tiny. Okay, so you've got your four sides to your puzzle from series one. Now we're adding the important corners. Yay! (laughs) So the four corners of your puzzle are all to do with this topic that I love calling brain management. Series two is the equivalent of the corner pieces of your jigsaw puzzle. It holds everything together. Brain management is also your second step in how to coach yourself. The step after series one, defining, assessing and visioning. It's your second step in developing self-leadership, evolving yourself to the next best version of yourself and creating your midlife happiness journey to whole being happiness. Brain management is all about how to use our brains as the amazing powerful tools they actually are. How we can use our brains intentionally and on purpose every single day. So we move away from being at the effect of our brains, at the automatic effect of our primal brains, very clever things those primal brains, This is where we live our lives mostly unaware and unconscious of the patterns and dynamics playing out, usually beneath our awareness and therefore in our lives. And we move towards recognizing these patterns and dynamics, choosing intentionally which to keep and which to replace. We move towards redirecting our primal brain from reactivity to responding on purpose, from reaction to proactive response. And we move into self-leadership, shifting our very way of being in the world. So it's not just a whole lot more doing, but living into who we are at midlife and what we want to accept, add, develop, change, and live into more fully. I know, (laughs) what an exciting, crazy concept. (laughs) And there are four corners Four basics, four cornerstones to brain management, just like there are four corners to your happiness puzzle. These are four brain management skills that we'll be coaching on in this series too. These are tools to take along with you on your journey of the rest of your life. And these are meta skills to use throughout your life. You'll hear me talk about meta skills quite a lot. And basically they're skills that we learn in one area of our lives and then extend 
into the rest of our life. These four are brain design, understanding your brain structure, how it works, how to integrate into your daily life all that we're learning in neuroscience, meditation, the art of living as observer to your thoughts, to your mind, growing your heart connection and connecting to your core being, your body as brain, yes, believe it or not, your body as your second brain, and the mind-body connection, and think, feel, act patterns, how to unwind the unhealthy, unhappy patterns that run you every day, unwind them and then start building the ones that create joy and contentment, purpose and meaning, they're the secret to the universe, to everything, so intrigued? I'll start off with four basic practices, one from each of these four corners that you can use as quick hacks to help you right now if you're feeling stuck, dissatisfied, unhappy, or even desperate for things to change, or to build on what's already working in your life. These four basics will bring you some quick relief to pain, unhappiness that you might be in. They'll set you up to see the good, the wins in your life right now, They'll unlock your self-judgment conversations, that inner critic, and they'll build through life awareness, bringing consistency to your good habits and giving momentum to your coaching. Then through series two, I'll develop the four basics into eight practices for your everyday to manage your brain on purpose and intentionally. Through coaching with me, you can develop these into lifetime skills. You can pick the ones that are most attractive and doable now. You can level up throughout the year and then keep leveling up and integrating them throughout the journey of your life. Brain management is an ongoing part of our lives. By combining these practices, you'll build your resilience. You'll be grounding yourself in living a bigger life than just those primal brain automatic reactions to whatever life throws at you. You'll be setting yourself up for a future life of shaping and creating your life on purpose and intentionally. So this is what we'll be doing in series two, looking at these four corners to your happiness in midlife, no matter what puzzle. And they're all essential in some shape or form, all four of them. They're essential to your resilience. They're essential to your creativity and they're essential to your thriving. I did a really difficult jigsaw puzzle through lockdown, the Mona Lisa. (laughs) So fun, especially after seeing that hilarious social media meme of the Mona Lisa in various stages of lockdown with her crazy hair. (laughs) I bought the puzzle years ago when I visited Italy in the Vatican shop, would you believe? And I've just finished it. And horrors of horrors. One of the corner pieces is missing. (laughs) I'm really quite devastated. Any of you who loves jigsaw puzzles knows what I'm talking about. It leaves everything very incomplete, unfinished, very unsatisfying. The completed picture looks wrong, out of sync really. And it's the same with these four corners of your happiness puzzle. The four basic skills of your brain management the four basics of your happiness. You need all four of them in some shape or form to hold your entire life together. Without one of them, without brain design, meditation, body as brain and think feel act patterns, your brain management skills are incomplete, your life puzzle is disjointed and your overall picture will never feel complete. If you're wondering what's inside the puzzle, what's inside the outline of series one and these four corners of series two, here's a sneak preview. (laughs) What's inside is what makes up your picture of midlife happiness, the artwork of your life. All the elements of midlife happiness, of whole being happiness, your very own crafted definition picture and journey of happiness. That's what's inside. 
You'll remember that series one is all about what makes up your own definition of happiness. What are your ingredients? What are the components of your inside picture? What's essential to your whole being happiness? Spiritually, physically, intellectually, emotionally, and in your relationships. In future series, we'll explore all these elements to pull together your final picture of happiness, your life map of what living from deep happiness looks like for you, how to be, how you think, feel, and act when you are connected to your purpose, to your source of joy, to others, to love. Now, I don't want us to wait to complete series two before we start adding life and color to this inner picture. During series two, I'm going to do bonus episodes on the biggest contributor to happiness above all else, our relationships and social connections. So mixed up in series two, in between discovering the brain management skills and tools, I'll be sharing wisdom and insights on relationships and happiness, coaching them, offering you some mind-blowing concepts to change how you currently see your emotional intelligence or your lovability, for example, and I'll be sharing ideas from my clients on moving ahead into whole being happiness through the vehicle of relationship. Something else to look forward to in series two ahead are my midlife habit challenges. These are new to the podcast this year, and I'm very excited to be opening them up to all of you, all my podcast listeners. Three times in 2021, we'll get together as a group online. You'll pick one of the brain management skills you've heard on the podcast or discovered through coaching with me already. And then over the challenge, we'll explore what it means to start a brain management habit, make it part of your everyday, and ultimately integrate it into your very way of being in the world. The first habit challenge of 2021 starts in March, so be sure to subscribe right away to my weekly coaching emails on happiness-matters.coach. Now, do you want to get off to a strong, exciting start to 2021? A life of resilience, creativity, and thriving in your midlife. Do you want to go from puzzled to happy in your midlife right now? So get started on your coaching journey with me now. Meet me today. We can discuss coaching together. See what you're looking for and how I can help you. It's as easy as one click from the website, happiness-matters.coach, to find a convenient time for us to meet. Perhaps you want to reassess your relationships through the pandemic, or it's time to pivot your career, even retire. Perhaps you're ready to learn how to coach yourself and access your own wisdom so that you can show up as the best version of you in this next phase of your life. Maybe you just don't want another year like last year and you want to integrate what learnings 2020 brought you. I have two options if you want to work one-on-one with me, directly with me. My short, powerful Relationships Turnaround Program to address unhappiness in your relationships and social connections, whether it be family, in-laws, work, social or love, It's your midlife relationship reset. And then there's my midlife crafting in 108 days, where we deep dive into your life over four months, transforming difficulties, reinventing your midlife and crafting your very own happiness jigsaw puzzle. Now's the time for this. (laughs) It really is as we enter another extraordinary COVID-19 year. Please book a free meet and greet session with me this week so we can meet each other and decide what's the best option for you. A short, powerful midlife relationship reset or 108 days of reinventing your midlife. You can do this right now on the website happiness-matters.coach. Choose the yellow button right at the top Coach with Julia. Choose your date and time and we're set to go. As a very last reminder, 
especially if you're new to Happiness Matters. You'll find everything on the website, happiness-matters.coach. You can find all previous podcast episodes with links, the free coaching tools from the podcast, articles, videos, and audio clips, and as I said, my availability for us to meet and discuss coaching. Okay, so there you go for today. A brief walk through all of Series 2 Brain Management and what's ahead. What a time there is ahead for us together. Just what we need for 2021. In the next episode, we're getting stuck right in. Now there's an unfortunate word. (laughs) Stuck in midlife. We're starting with the first step in managing our midlife brains on purpose and intentionally by looking at what reptiles, Velcro and Teflon have to do with our midlife whole being happiness no matter what. (laughs) May you be happy. May you be free. There is no better time to coach together. Bye for now. I'm heading off to the beach to get some sand between my toes. Thank you for joining us on this Happiness Matters podcast, coaching your whole being happiness in midlife. To join Julia for more of her midlife conversations, subscribe for free to her coaching notes by email and to this podcast. Search for Happiness Matters in Midlife to find us in your favorite podcast player app. Once you're subscribed, both of these will be delivered to your device automatically. To find all of this, click the subscribe menu of our website, happinessmatters.coach. That's happiness-matters.coach. C-O-A-C-H. And thanks again for listening.